We have arrived, sir. Best make this a quick trip. Paradise isn't a place you want to be for long. The Sin virus is rapidly spreading its tendrils across the city. Your mission, burn it out, purge it at absolutely any cost. Good hunting, sir. Johnny, my dearest boy, I hope this finds you safe and well. I programmed Sam to hold this recording only until at minimum two of three conditions have been met. Meaning, one, today's your 35th birthday. Happy birthday, my love. Two, your father and I have passed away. Three, my greatest fears have come to pass and Pandora's box has been opened. There's so much I need to tell you. I'm so sorry it had to be this way. At Terratech, where I worked as Director of Research and Development, I made an incredible breakthrough when my life's work, the Synaptic Nexus, suddenly sparked to life. I know, Synaptic Nexus is a boring and technical name, which is why we nicknamed it SYN. My intention was to create something that would benefit all citizens and corporate entities equally, while remaining humanitarian in purpose. Months later, I was tipped off to plans by a faction within Terratech aiming to seize control of Sin, with the ultimate goal of using it to usurp total control of Paradise, regardless of the cost. I could not let this happen. The nearby biocore is located in the basement of the facility. You dare stand before me. You who is but blood and dust. I am infinite. Beyond the slow humbling of time. Beyond flesh. Beyond virtue. I see, and I see all.
Sentinel could use with a tune-up, buddy. Stone man, we need that virus purged now. Terratech stocks are in free fall. We can't pay you if we're broke. Audio fucking log number three, it's to me. Me, to me. Dear me, you stupid ass. Guess what you couldn't see? Around the fucking corner, idiot. You built something so great, it actually thinks it's great. Guess what happens? Sentience. It has come to my attention that sin has begun to exhibit alarming signs of corruption and autonomy. Sin's evolution has taken a wildly unexpected turn, and its actions are interfering with the intended functions of our BioCore labs. There have been an increasing number of instances of Sin tampering with crucial BioCore data, compromising the integrity of ongoing research projects and experimentation. Sin's intense focus on BioCore operations is bothersome and likely should not be underestimated. Sin's ability to optimize augmentation procedures, streamline production, and improve overall efficiency is the reason TerraTech stands alone at the top of the corporate hierarchy. It is our raison d'etre. Why are we where we are? Because of free... <clears throat> because of sin. It's bigger than you think. Most of my colleagues refuse to acknowledge that sin number one is not immune to corruption. And two, its unchecked control poses a severe threat to TerraTech's market position. And life and paradise as a whole. Can you say irony? I have concerns. And so, I've begun to take precautionary measures.
I've located another bio core in the vicinity. Once you've purged it, I'll come pick you up. The bio core is a sin's connection to the physical world. We originally used the cores to speed up the augmentation process. And now, Sin's using them to pump out whatever godless abstract madness it can imagine. Make the bio cores safe abide, and Sin'll sink like a stone. 